There are many ways of sending messages, conveying information to other people. To us at work, this most often means sending a letter. A letter has two functions. It's a messenger conveying what we want to say to the person who receives it. And it's an ambassador giving the outside world an impression of the writer and the organization he works for. Oh, listen to this. Consequent on preliminary investigations duly undertaken by an appropriate technical officer whose responsibility it is to conduct an overall preliminary survey into the pompous idiots. A good letter must do two things. It must be understood and it must give the right impression about yourself and your organization. No, no, that's too cold. But it's not always easy. Dear sir, with reference to your esteemed inquiry concerning uh, it's not too hard either, is it? Mm. Dear sir, your valued inquiry is at hand, and I have pleasure... Dear sir... Excuse me. Oh, hello. May I ask something? By all means. What exactly are you going to say? <laughs> well, that's what I'm trying to decide. What do you prefer, um, valued or esteemed? No, you haven't understood my question. I asked, what are you going to say? Not how you're going to say it. Oh, what I'm going to say? Well? Well, I'm going to uh, answer this inquiry. We sell carpets, you see. Uh, I've had this letter from a hotel uh, asking about grades, prices, laying and so on. So, what are you going to say? Well, uh, May I suggest, uh, uh, if you're going to send a message, shouldn't you first decide what it is that you want to say? Mm. Yes, well, perhaps I'd better make a list. And I'll make a rule, the first rule of good letter writing. Decide what to say. Before you do anything else, get clear in your own mind what you want to say. Only then can you get it clear in someone else's. Yes. I've done that. May we see? Yes, ma'am. How's that? Looks all right. Now what? Now what, what? Is that all? Yes, that's a lot. In that order? What do you mean? Are your ideas in a logical sequence? Or will you be jumping from here to there and back again? The bit about Underfeld. What, this? Yes. Shouldn't that come higher up? Immediately after the bit about carpeting, you mean? Oh, I see. Right. Yes, and of course, that should come next. There. Oh, yes. And of course, this bit should be up the top. Yeah. Right, I'll call that number one. That will be two. And that so that brings us to rule two. That's Having decided what to say, put it in sequence. A logical, orderly sequence. Doesn't look very orderly. Perhaps you better make a clean copy. Just what I was thinking. See what you've done? Something wrong? No, something very right. You've divided what you're going to say into clear steps. Paragraphs, in fact. That's good. It's essential. Suppose you received a letter with no paragraphs. Oh. Like this, you mean? Yes. What impression did it make on you? Depressing. And could you understand it? Oh, eventually. After I'd read it three or four times, I felt as if I'd been hit over the head by a typewriter. I can imagine. So, each of the subjects I've got here should be given a separate paragraph. Is that what you're trying to say? That's it. Rule three? Absolutely. Rule three. A paragraph for each step of the sequence. It not only makes the letter pleasant to look at, 
It helps the reader to understand by telling him when you finished one step and are starting another. If the letter's complicated, covering a lot of different topics, it's a good idea to give each paragraph a heading, showing right away what it's about. Always try to keep paragraphs short, down to four or five lines, say. But if a topic must be dealt with at length, don't hesitate to use subparagraphs and give each one a number. Right, I've got all that. Can I start? Well, another rule. I'm afraid so. Tell me, how are you going to start? Well, something like, um... Dear sir, with reference to your inquiry, we have three grades of carpeting, the choice depending on time. Uh, just a moment. Now what? Well, think. That opening may be all right here, but at the other end, it's going to have to take its chance with all the rest. Dear sir, with reference to your inquiry... What inquiry, Miss Rogers? I'll check the file. What was the date of our letter? Dental doesn't say. Yes. Well, that doesn't work very well. So, how should you start a letter? Um, well, by telling him what it's about, I suppose. Yes, exactly what it's about, including a reference, like this. Dear Mr. Robinson, thank you for your letter of the 12th of March. Dear George, then put a heading in caps. Delivery schedules. Dear sir, I am writing to ask you for further information about cellulite, which you advertise in this month's journal. Get the idea? Yes, yes, that makes a lot of sense. One of them gave his letter a heading. What about that? Very helpful. Most letters are the better for one. Then you'll be sure of observing rule four. Immediately identify the subject. So the chap at the other end knows right away what it's all about. Any more rules? Just one. To do with the other end of the letter, how you finish it. Ah, well, yours, sir. Uh, faithfully, yours truly, yours sincerely. No, not how you sign off, but the final thought you want to leave in the reader's mind. I must ask you to settle this account within seven days. I would be glad if you would let me know when you will send us the samples. What do those endings point to? Well, what happens next? Which gives us rule five. End your letter by pointing the way ahead. Never leave the other man wondering what the next move is. Yes, like telling him I'll arrange a visit from one of our reps. Well, thank you very much. You've been most helpful. Have you got it all? Well, let's see. Rule one, decide what to say. Rule two, put it in sequence. Rule three, a paragraph for each step. Rule four, immediately identify the subject. And rule five, end by pointing the way ahead. So you're all set. And ready to go. All I've got to do now is write it. Dear sir, let's leave him to it, shall we? Contract carpeting heading. With reference to your esteemed inquiry dated the 23rd of...